Okay, good day everyone. Today I want to share face terminal. Okay, this face terminal I want to do the anti passback features. So regarding this anti passback features, we need to use a RAS for effect cable. I will send the uh, my video will present the uh, wiring over here. So they have a two unit over here. So for K1 T321 uh, for this model, uh, I prefer you all connect to the asset connect to the LAN cable first. Then you have to do the activation through the PC. It's the most more easier. Okay. Okay. On the wiring diagram, as you see, I just normally power up the first reader on your on the left hand side, but with the EM lock also on the left hand side. Okay. So the wiring is going to be like that. But you make sure they have a RX Wi-Fi cable from yellow blue connecting to the another my right hand side. The Devices the base terminal, so this is how the wires look like. Okay, okay so this is uh, enter my PC view. So we're going to set SFTP. Okay, you I already see the two network I already connect this two K1 T321 into a same network. Okay, so we over here we just click on it, we just activate it. So I'm using my the password I keep always using, but for your case, you have to activate by your own. Uh, Okay, so on the security question, I just put on to three lah. Okay. So security question I set. So I confirm another one more time. Okay. So it's done. So it's done successfully. So I set the IP address. So the IP address is going to be one six eight dot one eight two one six eight dot zero dot something lah. Two zero one start on two zero one lah. So eight thousand two ah in the gateway. And uh, this I put my own password. Okay, so done ready. I have a done two zero one and two zero two. Okay, so once this done ready, we able to access directly over here. So if we pop up this connection, we we'll, we just done the advance going to the. Uh, okay, one, two, three, two, one. The same times. So I access over here already. So I put back my password. Just now I activate the password. Okay, over here we have to take note of fun things. Uh. So over the uh, the configuration here, that one security. Okay, this security part we have to take. Have to take everything over here. Because if not, they will not able to send the data to the platform. Okay, so we save over done. Okay, so I go into the same thing, another devices. So when this done ready, you go into the configuration also same, enable the <coughs> security. Take over here. Safe. Okay, that's all that is an uh, important thing. Uh. So after that, we have to register the person. Okay. So how we enable the register the person is quite easy. We can do it on the machine there. Okay, so we back to the, the machine there to do the uh, register of the employee. Okay, so we back to this uh, interface. Okay, this is a real life. This is exactly the K12321. Okay, you hold OK to enter menu. Okay, so we enter the password over here. So you done ready, we enter the user over here. So we add in a person. Okay, so so we pick a name. Okay, for here I just put a te technical lah. Okay, T. Okay, so department face. I register my face over here. Done 
already. So we can resist a cut. Okay, so we resist the cut also. So done ready. So we can cut. Okay, done ready. So we're back. So now it's done ready. But for over here, I want to do is uh, make sure this is the person type because I want to do this as administrator. Okay, so it's done ready. So the person is done. Okay, we click as a person. So we back already. We can able to authenticate by face or card. So now I have another right, another over here that I haven't to done any link yet. So we only can do is from the uh, website to sync all the those data into these two, uh, these two K one, these three, two one. Okay. Okay. So we back to the our PC view. Okay, we go into IBMS four thousand two hundred. One thing, because the because this is a face terminal, we need to sync our data together to done the multi uh, to done the authentication. So we go into the okay, last year, go into device manager. Okay, we add the device. Okay, the firstly the device we have to know that oh, this is the first device. That means it's the main entrance. The main main entrance. Okay, so I put the IP address. So I put the username. Password. Okay, another I main is I do the sub. Okay, so that also. So we did have a main entrance and main sub. Okay, so that's why I have a two over here. Lah. So the data I just now I resisted is on the main entrance. <coughs> so we have to sync the data first. But before that, we have to done a little bit over here so we're going to the asset uh, person with the sync the data so how we sync the data we easily just get it from the device you will get from the main entrance or you will import it okay then we can using back our access group access control to sync the data okay so we here over access group we able to sync the data okay we take one you get everything by all the devices. Okay. Yeah, over time already. Now. now we have to do the anti password. So it's up to you. You want to do this part first, or you want to do an anti password first? Because this is majorly for the user data. So that I am going to uh, try over the real life there. Okay. So we back to the, this uh, another function that have a more parameter. So more parameter over here do you notice that main entrance and main sub right isn't it? So you're going to main entrance with double check on the RIS 45 cable because we link to my RIS 45 cable. Okay, so now it's done ready for the card reader. So it's done, it's nothing to do everything over here, but over my main sub. What I do so the main sub over here we back to the RIS 45 cable. RIS 45. So we connect by RIS 45 cable. So over here we change to the uh going to the access control device okay so access control device we maintain this on the card number or the person number but usually have the card number so we put two okay save on it so the device will be automatically so the device is putting right now lah so I have another one more thing is the uh, one function over this part okay do you notice they have like Password over here. So the anti password we have to do the main entrance. Okay. So the main entrance we have a enable that okay entrance card reader. So we take over here as an exit and we take over here as an entrance. Okay. So we save on it. So that's the things are how to do the uh anti password features. Okay. Okay, so we back to our this real life. So over here, as you see, uh, I'm able to access. Okay, and I, I try to access again. We show anti pass back. So the anti pass back feature is running. So I'm going to exit. So the door is open already. So that is how we do. But we test one more in the by using our face. So I put the camera over here. is open I try one more time we show anti pass back okay so at this I able to not like face also okay this is the way I can for watching please like and subscribe to my channel